Hello everyone, welcome to the second installment of the Critical Reflection Syntheses. This week we have Mike and Sarah providing their summaries of the discussion thread topic. So let's see what they had to say. Greetings, this is Mike Saunderson. This is Critical Reflection 3, Assessment and Synthesis. This week we look back at school technology and how it impacted our learning experience. 16 topics were chosen, and after reviewing the topics, I was able to see how each technology impacted the presenter. I would encourage every one of you to review each of the, your fellow students' technology. It was eye-opening to me. What was its intended purpose? Instructional delivery was mentioned by Candace, Lindley, Shelby, and Daniel. Language acquisition was mentioned by Saul and Hay. Mike's technology was created to assist the military, and Allison explained that YouTube was created as a dating service. All of the reasons why the technologies were created were very fascinating. What human value did the technology embody? I created a Wordle that included all the words used by the students to show what human value did the technology embody. The words that were are in the larger font were used multiple times. For example, power was mentioned six times, conformity five, accessibility, achievement, security, and self-direction three times. What was the unintended consequence of the technology? Natalie suggested how to get through a class by using technology to her advantage. Kristen suggested film strips radiate learning. Allison, Mike, Lindley, and Hay suggested that there was a Faustian bargain. And finally, Elizabeth suggested that her technology inspired more research. In summary, these are my thoughts. Readings were included in the human values and unintended consequences section and were tied in really well. It seemed that each selection had a personal story behind it and an instilled an emotion heard in each presentation. Reviewing everyone's presentation provided me an insight on all of this cohort, more so than a traditional class inter introduction. It, finally, in the age of Zoom meetings and social distancing, this assignment drew me closer to the 15 other students. Thank you very much. Aloha, everyone. I'm Sarah Espinosa, and I'll be doing our week four reflection synthesis for LTEC 676, looking back at school tech. We'll take a look at our tech choices and look at the tools from each learner. We'll look at the human values that we pulled out, some big ideas and the ways our thinking overlapped, pros of technology, cons of technology, including the unintentional negative consequences of tech, and a wrap up. So what tech choices did we make? I've grouped them together so you can see some of our overlap and similarities in thinking. We have four people who chose um, media with educational films, VHS tapes, film strip with audio, cassette, and educational films. We've got a math section with handheld calculator, scientific calculator, and my math lab, and we have chalkboards and overhead projectors. We also have some language learning with Rosetta Stone, cassette tapes for language and music, and the language lab. Enter the computer age, and we've got Apple IIe computer, YouTube, internet, SimCity, handheld tuners, and practice pages for handwriting. All right, let's take a look at some of the human values that we pulled out. I gathered all of the refined theory, basic values, and giant list of human values from each of your reflections and put them in this word cloud. From that, we can see the top four that we all chose were conformity, power, self-enhancement, and openness to change. Some of our bigger ideas in the main big idea is that human element is the most important. So some tools were technology centered, some tools were teacher centered. Autonomy was mentioned multiple times. Many of our choices blended and merged with each other. We mostly agreed that tech still needs community and guidance and many of our tools had Faustian bargains. What were some of the pros of school technology? Things mentioned were the ability to visit new worlds and have a change of pace in the classroom. There was a benefit of having autonomy and power of choice, improved perceptions and value of education, enabling creativity and achievements. 
Some of the cons of school tech included equity, cost, using tech as a babysitter, the technology remaining static, not having the proper training and having poor execution of the technology, accessibility issues, and a lack of guidance. So that just about wraps it up. I really enjoyed listening to all of your reflections, and I hope you all had as much to ponder as I did. Thanks so much. See you next week.